welcome back. Hey, welcome back. Welcome back, family. Hey, and if you're new to this channel, my name is Amber, and on this channel, we review fragrances and body care, and we spill, sip a little tea from here, and then your sis may go left, but that's okay. Just subscribe, give it a thumbs up, comment down below. We'd love to get to know you and meet you, and hey, family, hey, I hope you all are doing well. Hey, new family, I see y'all coming in. I hope you all are doing really well. Well, let's get into it. Honey, do you all have any pet peeves? You were getting on my nerves. And what I mean about pet peeves, you know, some things that just like get on your nerves, okay? Just just rocks your world just in a, a different realm, okay? So my top five. One is price and longevity. Honey, I can't, I don't know if it's just me, but I can't stand to something that's 400, 500, 600, some odd dollars for a fragrance and uh, you don't let like. It's like, I, make it make sense. Uh, make it make sense today. Um, I cannot stand when we have like just a big old price just because of the name, you know, just because, oh, um, and I'm not saying it's this person, but let's just call it, uh, like Tom Ford. You know, I'm not saying like, oh, we got, you know, Tom Ford and this big old price. If the longevity is not there, I'm looking at you side eye like for what? What was the point? Do we have a point? Um, for me, if I am about to pay a price, not to say that it needs to last 24 hours, right? It doesn't have to last all day, every day. It doesn't have to last into the night. But when I say three hours, the devil is a liar. Mm -mm. I'm not doing that. I'm not spending my coins on something that does not last long. Period. Okay? <laughs> Moving on. Next on my pet peeve list, I have to talk about it. Honey, the discretion, or I should say, no discretion of the overspray. I feel like, I mean, I'm an oversprayer, right? I overspray, I get it, I feel it. But if you overspraying something uh, that already at one spray knocks the people out. Disrespect. Okay, just being disrespectful. Like, why we gotta be knocking the people out with our fragrance? Like, I, I just don't understand. Okay, do you want to offend the entire room? Is that the point? Because that's not really the point of fragrance, to offend people, right? It's for you to smell good, okay? For you to get compliments, you know, for you to feel good. Uh, I know you ain't spraying no oud on top of oud fragrance and you overspraying. For what, sis? For what? Know your fragrance. Okay, have some discernment, okay? Think of others. It's not always just about you. I mean, a lot of things are, but not everything is about you, okay? It affects those that are around you. My goodness, calm down. Huh, mm. next. So next up, I have talked about this before um, on my channel about my biggest pet peeves. And one thing I just don't get, okay? You going into a Sephora, you going into an altar and you stink. Um, I know that there are people that may not have accessible resources to possibly get a bath, you know? Maybe they're homeless, maybe they're, you know, going through something. I, you know, there are some people that do not have access to take a bath. I get it, got it, good. But would you be in Ulta? Would you be in Sephora? Would you be at Dillard's? But anywhere that is beauty and fragrance products, would you really be there if you don't have some access to water and soap? Right? You know, you know, I don't understand going into an Ulta or Sephora, let's just say, and you not taking a bath before you get there. Sis, like the... The lipstick, the makeup, the fragrance, if it ain't there, uh, by the time you get there, it wasn't meant for you. It wasn't meant for you to have. Ain't no way you getting up out of bed, missing the shower part of it, coming into Alta or Sephora and standing by me, standing by people, and, and the funk is funking up. It's loud. Uh, you missed the entire step of the deodorant. I, that is my biggest pet peeve. I mean, why do we all got to suffer 
uh, because of you. Because you decided to wake up and not put deodorant and come to a Sephora and, and oh, to, I, I just don't know. You all see, you, you, my hands is getting a little bit handsy. Mm. Can we stop doing that? Um, just, just take, you know, um, I said it before. Um, I believe the people, we call it a, a, a whole bath. Um, do something, okay, that involves water, soap, and deodorant, okay? Next on my list of my biggest pet peeve would have to be an automizer that sprays straight out. Um, so what was the point? Did we want it to be a hose? Like you're spraying a hose and you're spraying the people and just going, bzz, bzz, bzz. like, I need a mist, right? I need, I need it to go over my body, not just like, ding, like what, what? Automizer, I, I can't stand when an automizer on a fragrance is straight please tell me the point comment down below and tell me why did we want a straight shooter automizer i, I want no parts i want no parts uh that in any fragrance i want a mist i want it to be just clean and a beautiful mist to come on my body and Miss me with the straight shooters, okay? I'm just gonna call it what it is. Just, just, just miss me, bypass me. I, I don't want to be a part of that, okay? <laughs> Moving on. And last, but certainly not least, honey. I can keep going and going. You know your sis, but I be trying to wrap it up, okay? <laughs> but one of my biggest pet peeve, uh, honey, why the cat gotta fall off, okay? Companies. In fragrance land, hear me now. Can we have a cat that actually stays on? I would love for you to put money into the uh, packaging of the beautiful fragrance. Um, and not just have the cap just flimsy, falling off, falling on the floor. You can't even pick it up. Can we put a little bit more into the cat? You know, um, please and thank you. Warm regards. Uh, thank you in advance. I just need us to have a cap that stays on the fragrance bottle. Cause wasn't that the point when you made it? What was the point of you making it and it don't stay on the uh, fragrance bottle? You feel me? I mean, questions, comments, concerns. Yeah, we need for that cap to stay on the perfume bottle. Thank you. Moving on. Well, that's all, that's all family for my top pet peeves. <laughs> what are some of yours? If you all would like to see a part two, I tell you, I got a list <laughs> so I can come back with more, but let me know what are some of your biggest pet peeves. I know you got them, honey. We all got them. The most positive person in the world. You got something that irk your nerves. You know, I see you. <laughs> Make sure you subscribe. Give me a thumbs up, comment down below. We'd love to get to know you and meet you. And hey, family, hey, make sure that you're good to yourself. Give yourself some grace. And if no one has told you that you are more than enough, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> your sis just did. Bye, family. I love you so much. Bye.